Hi guys, it's Meg. Welcome back and thank you so much for watching. So today I have a little outfit of the day slash kind of inspiration type thing I wanted to share with you guys. So it's a little bit more dressy than my typical everyday wear for sure. Um, this is not something I would wear like dropping my daughter off to school, but definitely I feel like a super cute outfit you could wear out to dinner or lunch or if you're going out with your girlfriend, something a little bit more casual, but you want to be a little bit more kind of like dressed up than normal. So I want to share with you guys a couple pieces I'm absolutely loving for fall so far. Now I have on a lot of light, I feel like, pieces, um, but I paired them with darker shoes and a darker hat. And I feel like I'm still seeing a ton of girls wearing like white jeans and super cute outfits like that, but I feel like if you guys have watched me before, you know I don't really wear white jeans. I've just never found a pair that works well for my body type, so that's just my personal kind of hang up. I just have never found a pair I love, so I figured I would do all white on the top and then I'm obsessed with these jeans and I wanted to share them with you guys. So first thing I have on is this hat from Gorin and it's kind of big but I really like it it's just a black felt floppy hat I will list a bunch of different alternatives down below that are also great options um, Nordstrom carries a ton of really great floppy like hats for fall my earrings are just Tory Burch logo studs my Latin low necklace rings today I have on these r little kind of finger rings and these are from I want to say forever 21 a long time ago and you can just stack them any way you want so I just threw those on my wedding rings, this is a shellac, and I think it's called something Brazil, Kiss Me I'm Brazilian, I think, something like that. Not the most fall color, but that was a whole other story. I'm going to move the camera and show you guys the rest of the outfit. just while I talked to you guys because I felt like it was kind of obnoxious in the video um, and I felt like it was making my face super shadowy so I love the hat though but for indoor purposes I don't really wear hats um I wanted to also share with you guys this black clutch this is a suede black clutch that I picked up from J Crew on sale last season I really love it it's just an envelope style clutch um, it's just a really nice basic to have and if you guys just saw it does have a chain detailing um, It's not long enough to go crossbody But if you are going out and say like you're going to dinner or drinks or you're going to be dancing or anything like that It is nice to have the strap option to put over your shoulder if you want But if not, this is just a really cute little clutch that you can tuck underneath your arm So I highly recommend these little envelope clutches from J. Crew. They're really nice. There's a back pocket and you can fit a ton of stuff in here. Definitely um, plenty big enough for your essentials just for like a girl's night out or something like that. Okay, so my blazer I love and it's by the brand Mural. I will link, um, I think the black one is still in stock, but this, I love the fit. This is a size small just for your reference. Um, I just find it helpful to know sizes because when I watch other lookbooks and videos, I it's hard for me to order stuff online without knowing. So just... For you guys, um, it's a size small. It does have built-in shoulder pads, and I'm already pretty wide at the top. Like, my shoulders are right here. So I don't necessarily need this, but it doesn't bother me. I kind of like that it's a little bit more structured at the shoulder since it is so long and kind of flowy at the bottom. This tank underneath is from Topshop, and I will list it down below. I just picked this up. It was on sale. A bunch of stuff from Topshop is on sale right now at Nordstrom. So if you're looking for any great basics, this is a really nice long tunic. You guys can see this is a size 6. I definitely should have gone with a 4. I don't know if the 4 is in stock. So I could have sized down for sure in the tunic and it would have still been plenty long enough. I'm going to move the camera so I can talk about the jeans. Okay, so I want to tell you guys about these jeans because they remind me a lot of the Gap jeans I wear all the time. And I get a lot of questions about those high-rise skinny Gap jeans. And these are almost identical to the fit. They are, you guys can see, cropped at the bottom. So they come right here where my boot um, is. They stop. I love the fit of these. They are pretty like skin tight. Like I can't really 
pull this off my leg at all, but they're comfortable. Um, these are size 28, and it says that in Topshop, they fit like a size 27, which is the size I wear in the Gap. So I still have the tags on these. I literally just got them in the mail. I love this long boyfriend blazer and the long Topshop tunic because as you guys can see, I have like this, up, the came, like the jeans have this upper thigh slit. Obviously this I feel like is not really that great. I'm like, my leg is kind of like bursting out of this top slit. Um, I feel like the jeans fit great. They're really comfortable. They don't feel super skin tight at the waist or anything. I just have uh, larger legs, so keep that in mind. But that's why I really liked pairing it with this white kind of flowy top and oversized blazer because it hides that one rip, which I feel like is a little bit too high for like a mom jean anyway. So I really like how this combination pairs with the jeans. And I love that these are so skin tight because it's really flowy and kind of like oversized at the top. So if you were to do a bigger jean at the bottom, it's just like too much fabric. So I like how this is super loose and flowy. And then you have the super fitted, super skinny jeans. Um, and they're a little bit distressed. So it keeps it, well, they are very distressed, but it keeps it a little bit more casual than doing like a black jean or a legging. And then I'm just obsessed with these Circus by Sam Edelman boots. They are seriously so comfortable. I feel like they just go with everything, and I especially love them paired with these crop jeans. Okay, so I highly recommend these Topshop Skinny Moto jeans. Um, they're amazing. So I, like I said, I ordered a size 28 because it says it fit like a US 27, and they do, they fit really great. Um, I can tell there's a little bit of stretch in them, but they aren't so stretchy that they're like pajama jeans. I really like them. They come up to about my belly button, so the fit is really, really similar to those high-waisted Gap skinny jeans. So if you guys were interested in those or the Zara high-waisted black jeans, but you are, I don't know, for some reason don't want to order from Zara or whatever, check out the Topshop Moto skinny jeans. I really like these, but just make sure you look at the size chart for Topshop because it is a European um, like sizing system. So they will give you the comparison to a U.S. size, but just make sure you take that into account because if I would have ordered a 27, they there's no way they would have fit. So I went with a 28 and it fit just like the size chart said, and I'm really happy with them. Um, if this particular wash is not available, I will link the other available washes. I definitely recommend you guys try them if you like a high-waisted skinny jean. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this lookbook. I feel like this is a really awesome fall outfit. I really like it, even though it's light and kind of bright. I think the boots and like the casual jeans kind of tone it down a little bit, and I think it's a fun twist instead of doing white jeans. If you don't have any, or, you know, whatever. I just really like the all white with the black accessories and the olive green. So I hope you guys enjoyed this outfit of the day. Definitely check out these jeans if you're interested. Um, any questions or anything like that, leave them down below. I will try and post as many of the items I talked about in the description box with the sizes that I'm wearing just so you guys can get a better idea of it. I know it's always difficult to order stuff online. So like I said, any questions, just let me know. I hope you guys are all having a fabulous day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.